Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Ross here, and bringing you another City Skylines video. Now today's video is actually on another mod, it's going to be a mod highlight, and the mod that I'm going to review is actually called the Traffic Report Tool, version 1.4. So as you can see up here in the upper left hand corner, we have a little magnifying glass with a question mark and we can click on that and we'll pause our game for a second and we're going to click on this truck right here. If we can highlight it. Okay. So you can see right here, if we bring it up and since we started the game, this is where he was when we started. Um, so it obviously it can't bring up information from a old save, but we can see where he's going. He's going to go down the highway, down over here, and see over here. So you can click on individual cars. You can click on pedestrians. Like we can click on, like, that little Taylor Cooper, highly educated senior. Um, and you can see, well, that she was going from here over to there. But there's gonna, she's going to take the bus from one stop instead of walking. Interesting. Um, or maybe she is walking. I can't really tell. But now we can also click on roads, okay? So we can click on the highway, okay? Let's click on right here, okay? So we can see right here that our highway is working as intended, where people are using uh, over here, getting on the highway um, at two different locations and then traveling down and going to their individual prospective homes. So our suburb and office park is working as intended with the traffic. Now we can click on this bridge right here, and then we can see like, holy crap, look at these numbers over here. Pedestrians, 686, cars, 88, cargo trucks, four, and so forth and so on. There's so many people walking. Like, like what the hell guys? Why are you walking so much? Like, I gave you all the mass transit, use it, you know? I, I gave you the train. I gave you everything. So, you know, it's a good tool to have. Like, you know, it can tell you, like, okay, like, look there. It's like, this road has a lot of traffic. And where is it all coming from? Now, it's, it would help you actually fix a problem. Like, if, the, let's say, we're over here, and we can see that people are getting off the off-ramp over here for some reason, then getting on this road to go wind around when they could easily just get on here and go over there. I don't necessarily know that. It doesn't make that sense. It doesn't make sense that they're making a right-hand side a turn just to go down here when they could just go straight as well. I don't understand that pathing. But, you know, we can click on this bridge and see that it's working as intended, where this uh, new high-rise district is feeding into here and also feeding back and feeding into our industrial park. So it's a really handy tool to use. Now, I'm not going to actually use it in my Let's Play series until I actually get all the achievements, but once I do get it, I will be using this, especially if I have traffic jams and try to figure out how to solve it the best way I can. And also, it can help you determine where to put bus stops, you know, where to put subways. You know, if you have a highly concentrated area using this right here, we could put a subway maybe right here, collect all the pedestrians, and then drop off the subway over here. It's an idea. I don't necessarily know if it would work as intended or, you know, but it's worth trying. So I hope this video helped you guys out and decide if you want to get this mod or not. You know, I know a lot of people don't like to download a lot of mods and I think this is a good mod. Very simple, just very basic information. Doesn't do anything really to your gameplay. Just gives you information. So guys, uh, guys, I hope that you enjoyed the video. And if you did, please hit that thumbs up. If you're new to the channel and you like my content, please subscribe. Welcome to the community. And as always, I'm the Flying Ross, and I'll check you guys next time.